Hello and welcome. Here we present our work on the far field speaker localization and adaptive GLMB tracking. Where do the sounds come from, you may wonder, especially when there are multiple sound sources at different locations arriving at the same time. Consider also when there are ambient noises and the environmental reverberation. This problem is part of the cocktail party problem, which is a difficult challenge and involves sound source localization, speaker localization, speech separation, speaker tracking, including location and sound, speech recognition, etc. Applications may include conference rooms, smart home devices, and vehicle assistance, This work is a continuation of the author's research efforts in the area of the cocktail party problem. So far, no ideal and final solution have yet been established in the field. Also, far field localization can be a significant challenge itself. We need efficient algorithm. Also, the GLMB as a label tracking framework seems to have the potential to incorporate multi-speaker tracking and the separation functions. The work is mainly an extension and a continuation of the author's two previous papers. The first paper is regarding localization, that is the onset MCCC and MCC-FET methods. The second paper is regarding multi-feature GLMB tracking for audio or speech signals. Let's briefly talk about the previous work. In conventional localization methods, the localization function is used. For example, the music, SRP FED, and onset MCCC, etc. Peaks of the localization function correspond to estimated source locations. This is not efficient, however, especially for a compact microphone array with few elements. For example, to scan 360 degrees with one degree steps, you run the localization function 360 times. This can be very time consuming. To be more specific, as shown in the equations, the previously proposed onset MCCC calculates the time delays across spatial grid, and then calculates the corresponding cross-correlation coefficients. Here, rho denotes the tested location, MI and MJ are microphone locations, V is the velocity of sound, Theta is the DOA, RS is the distance from microphone array to the speaker. To improve the efficiency, reverse mapping and linear interpolation is used. We can see that the maximum relative sample delay for compact array geometry is considerably less than the number of possible spatial grid points. For example, for a uniform circular array with a diameter of 0.1 meters, the maximum relative delay is about 14 samples for a sampling rate of 48 kHz. Therefore, we can only calculate the spatial points which correspond to integer sample delays per each microphone pair, and then linearly average spatial points in between and accumulates overall effect. The estimated set of source locations for each time frame k is denoted as big theta k. We also name the new method as the onset MCC for distinction. The generalized labeled multi Bernoulli tracking method has been used in multi-target tracking literature, but not often in audio or speech applications. For a brief introduction, the GLMB distribution can be written 
as this equation, where SK is a set of labeled speaker states. Here, SJK is a speaker state. Well, L psi K is a label associated with the candidate speaker and it is unique. And delta SK here guarantees unique labels. Psi carries association map between targets and measurements, and big Psi is a discrete space. Big L is checked labels, and omega is the probability of hypothesis. P Psi S is the probability density function <coughs> of states. The GRMB distribution propagates via the Bayes prediction update recursion, provided with the measurements, which are the estimated target locations, and produces the uh, desired speaker states. Here are some numerical results. State-of-the-art methods, for example, the SRP-FED, MUSIC, Neurofuzzy, MCC-FED, TFCSB and EB split methods are used as benchmarks. This figure shows the, the case when there's only one speaker at 45 degree DOA. A uniform circular array is used. You can see that a low reverb and uh, high SNR all methods work well. However, when the reverb increases, the TFCHB and the aspirate start to produce errors. This is the ground truth. We can see the peaks do not align. Performance of the all, all the other methods degrades as SNR decreases. But they still produce peaks close to the ground truth. This figure shows the case when there are two speakers at close locations. Still, we can see that the TFCHB and the EB split do not produce correct estimates, meaning that they do not have sufficient spatial resolution, even at low reverb and high SNR. However, our proposed onset MCC and MCC FAT methods can produce the correct peaks even at high reverb and uh, lower SNR. This figure shows the case of three moving speakers. The first row shows the location estimates of the onset MCC, MCC FED, Neurofuzzy, SRP FED, and MUSIC methods. You can see that the first four methods can produce accurate source location estimates. Well, the music methods did not work well in this case. We use the uh, OSPA metric to measure the performance. The OSPA comprises of two parts, the cardinality error and the location error. The cardinality error covers the misdetection and the spurious estimates. The location errors measure how much 
the estimates deviate from the ground truth. We can see that the overall OSPA estimation errors of the four, first four methods are below 5 degrees. This figure shows the tracking results using GOMB provided with the location estimates from the onset MCC method. We use the estimates for adaptive target birth. Note that this scenario uses real recordings in a room of 0.65 seconds T60. We can see there are misdetections. However, each speaker is correctly labeled and they form continuous tracks respectively. There are several things we can learn from this work. The proposed far field localization works as it improves the computational efficiency and achieves encouraging localization performance. The GLMB framework can be used for multi-speaker localization and tracking. This work serves as an incremental step towards solving the cocktail party problem. Thank you for your interest and welcome to reach out.